been a hot, 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 hot minute, but I'm in the mood to record some stocks again. It was been kind of chilling. I want to record, so I'm recording this again. I'm going to get back into it. I fell through for like two, three months. I have no idea. Days just kind of passed by. I know what I mean. But she even does her down. Just really, just really no other way to like around it to like say it. Like she even does her down. Like we're down here. We're down like 60 bucks, $34. Yeah, it's, it's okay though. Doge goes down, we buy more whenever it gets boom. You know what the hell's going on. But let's get into the meat and potatoes. Not quite. Acorns is up. I think last time I saw it, it may have been like 500. I think now it's at 700. Um, some more rewards. Obviously, up to 760 up big. We're doing the same stuff. I'm not a financial advisor. Don't take my advice. I'm just chilling here telling you how to do stuff. I'm not a financial advisor though, I'm not professional advice. I'm just a guy posting makings online. So we're up 50 now. We're up almost 8%, which is big. Uh today is Monday, June 24th at 2.23 p.m. There's all my investments and stuff that were occurring in my roundup. Remember, we're on aggressive. I'm young and crazy. We used to do things. Automatic. Um I actually was up. 10% up in VOO, which is big. Return up $36. I almost have a little share in VOO, which is actually crazy. I probably have a couple shares. Yeah. ICUS. Actually, I got a couple. A third. Well, I'm going to have VOO anyway. Oh, we can hear the music. We got a share and a quarter, roughly. A share and a fifth. Of medium IJH. Let's get into the meme sales for real, for real. What we'll talk a lot about right now is the big SoFi invest. We have 597. It's been very up and down the past month. I have to show y'all. So we're at 539, which the zero was around 560. So down five dollars relatively, down six dollars, down thirteen. Down eight, down, down, be a little up, up, back down, but we're like right there. So relatively 580. We're like right there. We're up, up, down, down. We did crack 600 though for a little bit. Uh, as you can see, the day changed up 47 cents, and the total gains is at 1288. So I'm going to scroll down. Um, you'll notice I have two accounts now. I have my future investing and my Roth IRA, which I finally opened. I didn't really want to, I just didn't want to stop. I don't really, I didn't really know what was stopping me. I just thought, why not? So then I just did, you know what I mean? Just my music really quick. Let's scroll down, see where we're at. That's how my deposits go. Not a lot, but it's all I can afford. The so DraftKings, let's go stock by stock here. DraftKings, I'm actually negative three, but I'm really putting money into it because I really think it'll go higher. Even though with this big dip, I think we're going to start. I think we're building up to something like a big like line line break. I forget what it's called. Stress point. I don't know. But compared to where it was in November 1st, we're up $14 in a year. This time last year, 25. So it almost doubled up 58%. I think you should put some options. I think it's worth it. So that's DraftKings. I think very profitable. Uh, it's becoming legal in like every state. Every other state probably is now. And I actually bought the SoFi. I have three and a half stocks of SoFi. Because <laughs> I'm a believer. I think, what, what was it they had? Oh, SoFi CTO sells. Oh, damn. Uh, you know, that's a sign of what's to come. Down to only five in that. It's something coming. I think with Zell rolling out and other stuff, I think you should invest, even if it is like a little bit down. And it's not as good as it once was, but I do think the, the boom potential is there. So I'm gonna believe until until it doesn't happen. And then Apple, you know, had that uh stock split or whatever they had we're hearing about a little a little while ago. But of course they've been going down because it's Apple and they're always controversial what they do. But in the past month, they're up. 
in the past three months where we'll really be looking at we're pretty big i've actually gained five dollars total from apple exciting look, look at that like fucking boom dude they really needed that i'll tell you what they needed that one and then i'm still in jd i'm still i'm still in the chinese companies i think the chinese boom hasn't really yet i mean my average trust was like 26 and it went up really high it got up all the way up here and it still didn't sell so i'm holding um you know dividends i'm getting my dividends getting my values up just slowly slowly i mean just by the dips of these i really feel like you i think jd and alibaba will boom just give it some time they'll hit above 40. where is it coming from vibes um my reliable select 500 etf is reliable as always we gained seven dollars i've put 17 i took i put six seven bucks into this three and almost three and a half shares and it's gone up to 30 percent the past year in the past month um seven percent that's not too bad for me and what i want for my just ets where i can just put me into and just be like oh look it's gaining money now could canadian pacific with the railways I'm not really too sure. I didn't really keep up this one like at all. But I know it's been going down and that was up for a little bit. Yeah, it was up. And actually I made a little bit of money, but I, haven't, I don't have a full stock owned yet. I've been kind of not buying into it as of late. Is it's been going down? That's my nice twice from the past year. But I think from the five year and the way this is going, it's a slow decline. I think It'll break into something pretty big. Uh, I'm not gonna talk about Vichy because Vichy just exists and it's whatever. Like, but waste management is another. Is this waste management? Waste management feels like an ETF. Put me into it. It's a very slow game, but the payoff is great. If I have money, I don't know where to put the waste management. Got 50 bucks in there right now. I mean, people are always gonna be wasting. You know what I mean? We just put like this. So just put the money in. And it's like just. Put it in, dude. <laughs> just, just put money in waste management. Warm Buffett has a ton in there. There's Alibaba as well. Uh, I got 33 cents. Had a little bit of a big boom. Um, but it's still down though in the month. We'll see right here. But even when it was up here, it did not sell. And I had a pretty decent cost. I just believe the companies will end up booming because like it has to recover, right? Got to. Another thing in physical like waste management, you just put money in, you get money out. It's Texas Roadhouse. I put money in, it gets me, this is my biggest gain of $11, decent, um, decent yield, so, I'll just see when, I mean, just look at this, it's five years up 200%, in the past one year up 60%, it just feels like free money, sometimes, you know what I mean, now that, now that I talk about it, I'm gonna get destroyed, I'm gonna get boned, I'm gonna start getting excited about something, it just, uh, my SoFi, other one, X500 ETF, just reliable, put money into it. I think this one's a bit lower than the other one. Oh, like very lower than the other one. I'm not picking up this one, I guess, too much. Now it's 66 cents. So, oh, Robert on Market? Look at that, it's in there now. When Resorts, oh yeah, it's the little Vegas properties. Okay, it's not too bad. And it trades, well. In the past year, though, up a little bit nothing crazy in the past five years up a little bit nothing crazy just roll with it you know what i mean just roll with it um i put money into gamestop as Roaring kitty was soaring up so you blame me i mean but it'll go down so i mean you know can't kind of in my portfolio not much but it's like and then i got into more etfs for we're gonna save reliable money i think i might move these into my um to my uh what's it called my roth ira but i don't want to overlap my roth ira with other openings i think it was doing voo in this one oh this is v10 sche oh okay i see no i'm not saying vo is my other one okay so yeah i split into those two i might be double dipping i'm not too sure but if we view the account just outright I'm looking at both one month six months we've been going up slowly i mean 
11 dollars total gains dividends up to two dollars now that's crazy so silly getting money i got 16 cents of buying power shouts out waste management dividend i'll show all of you my recent purchases and like your waste management apple gme gucci apple positive rewards i mean it's just it's just start investing sooner and later and who knows things might work out for you bye everybody